three fucked up signs that somebody with ADHD is actually listening to you. Comment down below if you know what I mean. First one is, is we will have no eye contact with you if we're actually listening to you. If we are making eye contact with you, guess what? We are thinking about everything and anything but what you're saying. None of it is being retained. But if we are not making eye contact, we're not using that energy to actually connect and, and force ourselves to look at you. So we are actually retaining and listening to everything you're saying. Another sign is, is that we're going to be fidgeting and we're going to be moving. We are not going to be sitting still. If you force us or make us sit still and we have to listen to you, guess what? We are not listening because we are using all of our mental energy to literally sit still and not move. And it takes a lot of mental energy. Now, the last one is, is we are going to interrupt you. We are going to over talk you. We are going to try and conversation steal from you. We are going to be very engaged in this conversation. It's very annoying sometimes. But the thing you don't realize is us being engaged, us trying to conversation hijack from you, over talking you, trying to finish your sentences, all this means that we are actually listening. We are comprehending. We're trying to make sure we relate and understand, but we're also actively involved in in this conversation. If we are not, and you're getting the uh-huh, yeah, guess what? We are not listening to you. We are not retaining anything. And when it comes down to it, did we listen to you at all at with that? No. So if we are literally cutting you off and trying to engage in this conversation, it's going to be really annoying, but it's one of the best signs that we are actually listening to you. I was diagnosed with ADD at 13. I was re-diagnosed with ADHD at 17, and I've lived with this all my life, and I like to share so that you understand and know what it is you're dealing with if you're diagnosed with ADHD and understanding others who are diagnosed with ADHD and why they do some of the quirks that they do.